the first step for your Aztec son is to write your name right in the middle of your paper. Once you have written your name, turn your paper over so that you no longer see your name. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to trace this big circle. You're going to put it right in the middle of your square, square paper, and you're going to trace it. Now there is not enough for everyone to trace at the same time at your table. So take a turn and give it to someone else. After tracing your big circle, then I'm going to take the little one and I'm going to trace it inside. Again, if there's not enough of these at your table, then sure. After I have my big circle and my little circle, I'm going to add a third circle in between the two circles. Now this circle can be different from the other two. It could be a zigzag, it could be a swirl, it could be kind of whatever you want. I'm going to go ahead and do waves. So go ahead and you can decide what kind of circle you want in between those two. I'm going to go ahead and erase that line. Now that you have one circle, two circles, three circles, I'm going to draw the face of my Aztec sun. I'm going to start with the eyes. Now you can do any kind of eye you want. You can do the same kind of eye as me, or you can do a different kind. It is up to you. I want you to make your own creative choice. Then I'm going to go ahead and do a nose. Now again, the nose can be the same as mine, or it can be different. Now my mouth, I'm going to make a nice big mouth with some big teeth on both sides. Again, if you want to make a different kind of mouth, it's up to you. You can make any kind of mouth you want to. Now I think I want to have a, a tongue. So I'm going to have to go draw my tongue and then go back and erase those lines. I have my two eyes, nose, and mouth. Again, it's okay if you, they do not look like mine. The different, the better. It's still missing something. I'm going to go ahead and add some eyebrows. You don't have to have eyebrows. In fact, you could kind of do anything you wanted from here on out. Okay? So I'm going to go ahead and add details to, to the inside of my sun. Doesn't have to be realistic. It doesn't have to be parts of my face or of a face. I'm just going to go ahead and make some creative choices and add details in my sun. Again, more and more details. So go ahead, start drawing details only on the inside of your sun. We'll get to the outside of our Aztec sun in a minute. So go ahead, start drawing the details of your sun.
Once you have all of the details of your sun, we are missing something very important. So we're going to add the rays. I'm going to go ahead and add some big triangles around my sun. I have some big triangles for rays, but I want more. So now I'm going to go ahead and do some big little skinnier ones, taller and skinnier. Maybe not so much taller, but definitely skinnier. And now I have bigger ones and little ones. If you wanted, you could e add even more. However, you are going to be cutting this out, so please do not make it hard on yourself. Go ahead and add rays. Big, skinny, all around. It's up to you. Make your own creative choices and finish drawing your Aztec sun.